then a nice shot block or a pass block rather made by Zach Risto, the Lakeville Minnesota native to keep it out of the zone. Oh, a nice trip now by Kyler Head. Three on one over the line, right side down the wing. Holds on to it, holds on to it, and he scores! Flying aces on the board with 132 left. In the opening period, Kyler had the goal. Stoviak and Drew Elser as well on the ice. Stoviak a check in front of the Aces bench. Now a feed all the way up ahead, pulling it free. Elser, nice move there into the right circle. Now to his back end, carries out front, trying to jam in near post. He scores! Oh, baby! What a goal! Drew Elser! Making the Youngstown defense dizzy, and then he tucked it past the left pad of the night. Minder, Prosvitev, and the Aces lead 2 0. Oh, a highlight reel there for Drew Elser is six of the season. And we'll get a look at the replay. He split a couple of guys on that one and somehow snuck it by the near post on Prosvitev. On the forehand from his backhand and the Aces lead 2-0. Line, meant to drop the left wing side. Into the slot, very right side of blast. That one was blocked by the Aces, came from Thompson's stick. Up the near side boards it goes. Near side point Metza down the wall to Thompson. The right circle fires kicked aside by Stasekul. Fought it off, I believe, his right pad or his stick uh, helped him make that save. Left circle Barry. Right side Thompson off his skate. To his stick, a blast, and he scores. Power play goal for Youngstown, and they're on the board to make it a 2-1 to one game. Rush coming now for the Aces. Drop pass slot, Laska. Right side now, Madden trying to feed it back out front. For Kafuku who was charging in toward the top of the crease, but that puck deflected in midair. Shot left wing, they score. Youngstown back the other way as Casaro left wing just handcuffed Stasekul, and the game is tied with 13.51 left in the third period. Pulled out of his own zone by Needham. He skates it ahead. To his left, he goes across the line for Esposito, who banks it deep, giving Chase Callahan. Battling behind the net for the puck alongside of Curtis Hall. Both guys, NHL draft prospects tied up behind the goal. Came free again to Hall. Guarded by Butala this time. Shooting near side circle, and he claimed it off the far glass. Follow-up try! A redirect in front. No, the wash it out. High stick, no goal. Played by a high stick by Youngstown. And they wave it off here. They may have a conversation about that, but what appeared to be the go-ahead goal for Youngstown with 5.57 left is waved off due to a high stick. And I don't believe, I do not believe we'll get a replay of that one. Oh, we are going to get a replay of that one. I don't think we're supposed to, but here we go anyway as we get a look at it. Oh, what are we going to get a look at? It's tough to tell on that angle. Just trying to force overtime now back in their own zone. Three left in the third period. Barry has collided with. He lost the puck. And there's the horn. We're headed for an extra session. So the first home game of the season at Grosinger Motors Arena. And 60 minutes is not enough to decide it. We will have overtime after this. We Trying to pivot away from a man. Carries back to the near side's corner. Step past the man. Then it was tied up by Casaro and couldn't get the puck back. He tied him back up again and Manning got the puck free. Spinning along the half ball. Lats go back to Wraith. Charges down left board. Send up front. Let's go! One time blast. Took a hit up high and he goes down hard and we'll have a penalty called. Oh boy, the first About to expire in about 10 seconds. Latska carries right wing. Sent it in front of the slot. Broken up. Chopped that to the far half wall. Ace hold the line. Two and one. The penalty time expires. Back to four and four. Race straight away. Fires off the chest of the net miner. Pros with him. Up high as he, he went down. Hit coming from Jinjo. Behind the net. Madden trying to pull it away. Six left in overtime. One last chance for the Aces maybe. It's floated the length of the ice. Will it be icing? It won't be. We're headed for a shootout. As the horn sounds. 
And overtime is not enough. We'll have our second shootout game in the last four contests for the Flying Aces. And this will be shootout game number three of the season already for Youngstown, only playing in their 10th game tonight. We We're back for the shootout as Youngstown shoots first down the right side. In on goal, Pertino faked the blast down to his forehand, and he slid it behind. Zach stays cold, tucked it behind him on the backhand, and Peratino gives Youngstown the 1 0 lead in the shootout. And Callan Kafuka chance to try to tie it in the shootout now. He accepts the puck at center ice. Across the line to his left, left handed shot now sweeps to the slot, carries, carries, holds on to it, fires, and turned aside by Prozvatev. He makes the save. First round done, 1 0 Youngstown. Whistle blows, he approaches the puck, charging ahead with it across the line to his left, out aggressively. Is the netmeyer pros attempt to his forehand man, and he is stopped. And now Youngstown has a chance to win it here on their third shooter. They will send out Max Ellis, the Notre Dame commit, right-handed shot. Whistle blows, now he goes, a chance to win it for Youngstown in the Shoot out here across the line down the slot he goes back and forehand slid it past Stace Cole and Youngstown wins in a shootout three to two.